Well, up next, Randy Orton is going to come out here and address what he did to John Cena's father. How is he going to explain that despicable act? Exactly. How do you explain the actions of a, of a viper? Well, Randy Orton's going to find, we're going to find out what Orton's doing out here next. We are back here at Ohio State University, Monday Night Raw. Raw General Manager William Regal stands center ring. Last week, Randy Orton demanded a rematch with John Cena for the WWE Championship, but I denied him. So Orton pleaded his case to Mr. McMahon, who told Orton that he would not grant him a rematch unless Orton could prove to him that he really wanted it. And unfortunately for the Cena family, that inspired Orton to do this. John Cena's a fistless here. And you know what Randy Orton has in mind. Randy Orton wants to oh, kick Cena's now. brains out. And Orton measuring John Cena. The legend killer. Stop me, Rick. My God, maybe Orton's got a conscience after all. Why'd he stop? Hey, hey, hey. hey, wait. What the hell was... That's John Cena's father. Now, I know Orton was supposed to be here this evening, but by the nature of those events, I gave him the evening off. But I do have him here via satellite. So, Randy, welcome and good evening to Raw. Thank you, Mr. Regal. Thank you very much for having me. I appreciate the day off, however, I wish I was there to confront the people that think that what I did last week was sick. But you know what? Call me sick. Call me deranged. Call me what you want. But John Cena? John Cena did this to himself. John Cena's father got his face kicked off because of John Cena. His father's blood is on his hands. And just to think, Cena could have prevented all of this from happening if last week he would have accepted a rematch with me for the WWE title. Well, I wonder, John Cena, do you want that rematch now? I have a feeling you do. I think we all do, Randy. That's why I'm here tonight to announce that at Unforgiven, it will indeed be John Cena versus Randy Orton for the WWE Championship. Thank you, Mr. Regal. I definitely deserve this opportunity. And one more thing for John Cena. John, I hope your father never forgives you for what you let happen last week. With that being said, I think we can continue with the show.
we still have an incredible main event with Triple H versus Umanga. And Carlito. Uh oh. Well, the champ is here. <laughs> John Cena. And he doesn't look like he's in a very good mood. How could he be, King? How could, how could John Cena be? How could he have been in a good mood whatsoever? After what happened to his own father last week, and John had to witness it. Most of the time, she wants father be assaulted. And be put in such severe harm's way as. Now, now, Cena, as general manager, I'm just doing my job. Wait a minute. John, don't do anything foolish. Don't do anything that you may regret. just been made for Unforgiven. A few seconds ago, the conflicted, the, 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 the emotional WWE champion John Cena assaulting the general manager, William Regal of Monday Night Raw. And John Cena, in my opinion, King, has just put his career in severe jeopardy. Well, you see, I, I'm sure that John Cena had been waiting all week long to be able to get his hands on Randy Orton after what Orton did to John Cena's father last week. But William Regal comes out here and announces that he'd given Orton the night off. And this is the price that Regal paid from John Cena. You can see, you can hear, you can feel the emotion of the WWE Champion and the damage done to the general manager. Let go, John, come on! 